I'm testing the penetrating power of three types of radiation. I've got some alpha, beta and gamma radiation. You can hear now, just with background, it's about 30 clicks per minute, so that's about 0.5 becquerel. If I put it over the alpha sample, you can hear it picks up. Now, I'll test that with a piece of paper. Paper seems to stop alpha particles. The paper stops it. A piece of plastic would also stop it. That's a piece of plastic. And of course aluminium will stop it. And copper stop it. So that's alpha particles. That's from an americium 241 sample. I'll move on to a strontium 90 sample. This is a beaver emitter. It's far more active. But you can hear uh, you can hear the activity. I'll put a piece of paper in there. Has no effect. So paper's not a, a barrier to beta particles. Try a piece of copper. Copper you can hear slows it down a little bit. Aluminium slows it down a little bit. I can use thicker aluminium. Now this is three millimeter aluminium. That stops it. So three meters of aluminium can stop beta particles. Whereas 0.8 of a millimeter of aluminium has no effect. Okay, and of course lead will stop beta particles. This is a piece of lead, five millimeters thick, and of course that stops it. Okay, I'll move on to gamma. Now this is a cesium 90 sample, and you can hear, it's not that active, but it's above background. Background's like that. And the sample's more active. Now, even a piece of lead, five millimetres thick, doesn't seem to stop it. So you need quite a few centimetres of lead to stop gamma particles.